What's going on, everybody? So I'm going to talk about this fight right here, this BS fight. So I'm, I'm guessing Gegard hit Dan Henderson with a jab. And for whatever reason, he started pointing at, at Dan Henderson's eye. He said that Gegard said that he saw blood in his eye or whatever. The ref said, continue to fight. And at that point, Dan Henderson got more aggressive. He was setting up the H-bomb, baby. The H-bomb, by the way, was trending on Twitter. You can follow me on Twitter, at MMA Genius. <laughs> it, the H bomb was trending on Twitter, and imagine seriously, imagine you don't know anything about Dan Henderson or MMA, and you see H bomb trending, you'd be like, "What in the hell's going on? Holy shit! World War Three up in this beast." Um. So anyway, Dan Henderson was pressing forward, setting up the H bomb. Gegard, L- Lig Gegard dropped a big bomb on Dan Henderson, hit him in the side of the head dropped Dan Henderson. Dan Henderson fell back against the cage. At that point, the stupid-ass referee started rushing towards them. Gegard got on top of Dan Henderson and landed one punch. While Dan Henderson was going for a takedown, he had a single-leg takedown. Okay, he was going for the leg, landed one punch, and the ref stopped the fight. As soon as Dan Henderson fell back, you watched the referee... Go for the fu- go and try to stop the fight, and he had to stop the fight. Uh, Dan Henderson immediately stood up and said, "What the f?" Horrible stoppage by the referee. Horrible, horrible. And I was not gonna make the video. This video, be- oh, this is, this was the first round. I was not gonna make the this video because there's nothing to say other than the referee effed up big time. But then I'm checking my Twitter. Yeah, a lot of people are retweeting me now. A lot of people are retweeting me now. This is the reason why I'm making this video. And then, of course, Dana White, being the promoter he is, let me go and see, type in, let me go and see, uh, okay, he, he said this. Not a bad stoppage. The refs are so sloppy. If the ref didn't tackle Musasi, he would have kept that top position. Dan would have got smashed. And this is what I re- replied. I said, oh, so you are are fucking psychic now. Okay, that's one thing that I said. The other thing that I said, let me go and check my Twitter right here. I said, uh, let me find it. Dana is basing this on something that did not happen. Getting up there with the stupidity of Joe Rogan and Mike Goldberg, too. So if you... He, by the way, he blocked me a long time ago. He blocked me a long-ass time ago. I mean, <laughs> he blocked me like in 2009. <laughs> the only reason I saw it is because MMA Fighting retweeted that. And, uh, yeah, so he said that it's not a bad stoppage. And Gegard would have smashed him and, and got the top position. So number one, so he's fucking psychic now. Number two, he's basing this on something that did not happen. Can you guys believe that? Out of all the fights you guys have seen, he's basing that stoppage on something that did not happen. Like I said, he's getting up there with the Joe Rogan stupidity and Mike Goldberg too. And for a lot of people that don't know why Joe Rogan is so stupid, all you have to do is look at his podcast. Cannot go one podcast without talking about drugs, gay stuff, whatever. And and uh, that's another guy who who uh, blocked me by the way. <laughs> Joe Joe fucking dumbass Rogan. Oh, uh, the only reason pe- the people the guys, guys seriously guys, the reason people hate John Jones is cuz he's black. Okay, Joe Rogan. I said, "Okay, Joe Rogan, go smoke some more too. Go smoke some more, buddy." <laughs> 